Hello everyone, I welcome you all to another software related video. In this video, I will simulate, I, I will just solve a optimization problem. The problem is how you will calculate the optimal solution of a given uh, objective function when certain constraints are given. So for that, I will use Lendo software. In order to download your Lendo software, go to your favorite browser and just type www.lendo.com and go to the download section and download this download classic lindo once you download this it's uh, easy to install install and when you open this for the first time you will see an inter interface like this this is a, these are the options that is if if you want to create a new new uh, window uh, press f2 or you can uh, press this new as well secondly this is the edit command window, this is the solve window, this is the report window, the windows and this is the help one, right? So what we are given in this uh, example, we will uh, learn this Lindo software with the help of an example. So for example, this is my uh, example, I want to maximize this uh, objective function that is the profit of circuit organization by producing three different materials. Material X1, Material X2, Material X3. The profit per unit for Material 1 is 20 and 20 for Material 2 as 12. For the Material 3, they produce 15 uh, uh, unit uh, dollar or uh, you know currency per unit. And these are the constraints. 7X1 plus 6X2 plus 3X2 should be less than or equal to 100. 5X1 plus 4X2 plus 2x3 should be less than or equal to 200 and all the constraints are greater than zero. So we will just implement this in our uh, Lindo software and let's see what our maximum or optimal solution is. That will be uh, maximize our profit. So for, for that, just write max, it's a case, case sensitive. So make sure to write in a small alphabet max, then 20 x1, then just write plus, 20 x2 then write the third one 15 x3 go to the next line and just type st subjected to right go to the next line and write down the constraint 7 x1 plus 6 x2 plus 3 x3 is less than or equal to 100 make sure that how you will write less than or equal to right the second constraint is 5x1 plus 4x2 plus 2x2 uh, should be less than or equal to 200 and there is no need to write this uh, bottom constraint or if you want to write you can write this for example x1 sorry x1 should be greater than or equal to 0 x2 should be greater than or equal to 0 x3 should be greater than or equal to 0 right and at the end just put end right once you've done this go to solve and press this solve or press control for pluses you can also press this uh, simulation button control pluses do you want to perform sensitivity analysis yes i want to do it's up to you if you want to do not perform sensitivity analysis just click no but i want to uh, do this right so click yes update in time just close this my solo my uh, problem is done now go to this window this is what i am getting the optimal function value this is the maximum value that this function can produce by uh, uh, keep considering these constraints in mind this says that the value of x1 is zero they will uh, produce or get profit by producing this product 0, x2 0 and x3 is 33.3332 right this is the this one and these are the reduced cost these are the reduced cost I mean that they will reduce their cost if they do not use this one right they reduce 10 cost 10 dollar or 10 currency per unit right and these are the slack variable the extra amount we needed for row 2 what was row 2 row 2 was 
the second the first constraint row, th row 3 was the second constraint row 4 was the third constraint and 5 and 6 similarly right so if you see that select variable is 0 for row 1 the select variable is 200 and 0033.33 and these are the number of iteration right in sensitivity analysis we see that the current value is 20 for x1 20 for x2 24 15 power x3 these are the uh, objective or the main objective coefficients right so how you can make some increase you can increase x1 by 15 units and x2 by 10 units while x3 can be increased by infinity how you can decrease this value in order to get the maximum profit you can uh, decrease this at minus infinity x1 x2 you can decrease this at minus infinity and you can increase uh, decrease x3 to 5 units right and these are the constraint to the right hand side you can if th these are the right hand side for the first constraint these are for the second constraint and these are for the third fourth and fifth constraint right you can in increase in the right hand side up to infinity similarly for this one for constraint number two while the decrease is almost 100 and almost 200 right and in infinite infinity you can increase and decrease this was what how you will get now let's see some uh, another row of some operation for example i just want to say that this is row one row one i will just place parenthesis say, after typing the row similarly i can write for this as well row two this one now again solve this yes i want to perform my sensitivity analysis close this this is the window you will get your answer this one right this is the second one right so where you get here it is row one row two similarly you can write for row three row four as well so that was a simple introduction to the lindo software uh, hopefully we will upload some more video so up till now uh, take care and make sure to subscribe and like this video thank you so much